for tuning in once again um for those who do not know me my name is notando villagazi and this is my channel i know i've been away for a very long time but i'm happy to see that i'm back and um first of all i'm sorry that i wasn't consistent with the clothing um yeah life happens <laughs> But uh, most of all the reason for that was that I was just a lot was happening and I just had to shift my focus to what that was happening in my life and right now I'm happy to say that I'm back and Okay, so in today's video, I just want to talk about teach English online Anyone can be a teacher as long as you can say my name is Trust me. You are a teacher. You can teach the next person how to speak English how to communicate how to read how to pronounce uh, First of all, you need to have um, a TEFL certificate. It comes between us. Uh, there's one for 120 hours There's one also for 150 hours with the teaching English certificate, which is the TEFL certificate, it rather equips you or rather it proves that you now have the basics of how to teach, the strategies to use, the techniques, uh, how to manage the time in class and all those things. So with me, I have completed the TEFL certificate and honestly, it took me long because I just wasn't really serious about it. But I believe that if you are focused and you really want to get this done in a week's time or rather two weeks, a month, if you really like. They gave me like six months to complete um, the certificate and it is very affordable. Where I did it, it was affordable because the amount I paid was 219 rand imagine because i know that some institutions or some academies you pay like 800 1000 rand 1.5 so it can be really expensive and so you have to finish it in a period of six months it's so easy to pass uh the mini test or can i call it a quiz because it's more like a quiz so when you do the english course try to take some notes as much as you can think ah oh, this is just easy operating a quiz take notes because chances are you will not uh, be able to recall most of the stuff since it's a lot of information more, more especially for the final quiz which is like the exam kind of situation so if you really want to make sure that you're doing this once and for all and you're done with it take some notes be it you're taking screenshots or you're just writing your notes down it doesn't matter but take some notes it's unlike a school exam where someone is watching over you this is going to later you can't be copying go do you if you feel like you just want to check the answer why not <laughs> i did mine with um tafel universal they have a first page they also have a um, website but i want uh, to also share with you guys is what equipment do you need because i do have the equipment uh first of all you will need to have some headsets that you can use for noise cancellation reasons and so you can buy this from take a lot and then you use them when you teach uh, it also enhances the sound quality um you also need to have a laptop you need to have a laptop or a desktop it is completely up to you and once you have that you also need to have internet access it can be wi-fi you can and then once you have that you need to have a webcam let me just show you my webcam when you're teaching online i just took mine because it was i had stored it somewhere else so it looks something like this and yeah you just insert it in your laptop with this and it just enhances the quality of the screen of the picture and everything so of the video of course so that you can the learners or the students can see you clearly um i got mine from take a lot it was on sale but they are really affordable i think you can get one for like 350 400 rand. i don't know mine was on special so it was a bargain and with that said i think this is like the basics that i think one of the requirements is that they require you to have like a plain background it shouldn't be busy people walking around and all that so it's more like something like this a plain background where the focus is just on you as the teacher and the students can focus on you well for some institutions they have like preferences do not cover your head 
this and that it just depends but most of all as long i believe that as long as you are presentable to the students then it shouldn't be a problem i really hope that you are going to use the information that i have just shared with you please do comment below if you need more information i am more than willing to explain the entire process to you guys i'm also going to um insert a link below which you guys can use if you want to rather register with uh the TAFL TAFL universal if you want to do your TAFL certificate with them because i have done it with them and i can confirm that they are legit you do get your certificate so that's basically it i, I hope that you are willing to take this and start your journey of being a TAFL teacher thank you for watching the video guys see you in my next upload